Hi, welcome back to Gossip and Grigio, and I have a new thrift haul for you. So, ignore my cat scratches. That's what you do when you have a cat, you just accept it. Anyway, um, so this is a St. John sweater. I'm just gonna get into it because I'm actually like really hot in my apartment. I'm just gonna get right into it. This is a St. John sweater. I got an estate sale for $10. I think retail is $300. So it's just giving me very Chanel vibes, especially with the heavy, there's cat hair on it, sorry. Especially with the heavy um, gold button. These are really good, like, um, uh, like there's like white enamel on it really good quality you can just tell by feeling them and then there's this little there's this little flower on the pockets and then you have the St. John badge here okay there you go it's a little faded but I love it and I'm just wearing it with this silk escada crochet pencil skirt and a Christian Ciarano cotton tank. So yeah, I think this would be like really cute. Oh, and this is just a little gold watch. I mean, a pearl watch I have that I got for Christmas. And yeah, so 10 bucks. I don't know, I feel like I need to go to brunch or tea with the ladies on the Upper East Side. Okay, the creme de la creme is this. Dun, da, da, da. Okay, just look, just look, just look, okay. What does this say? Oscar de la Renta, honey. Oscar de la Renta. Every time I think of Oscar de la Renta, I think of, um, do you watch Gilmore Girls? Um, the grandma's like stylist said Oscar de la Renta. And every time I think of Oscar de la Renta, I think Oscar de la Renta. Yeah, so this is the vibe, loving. Do I need another blazer? No, because I have a Laura Piano one that looks exactly like this. But this is a better fit and Yes, I'm here to make a deal. You can't talk to me because I'm an Oscar de la Renta. So the next thing is this Ralph Lauren um, cotton button down Oxford. This is exactly what I was looking for. Oh, it's crooked. Um, I really wanted a button down for the beach for like, I'll show you how long it is. I just put it with the skirt, but I really bought this to go over a bathing suit. It's so long, it's way past, way past my butt. So I got this for $7 at Goodwill, and I think the retail is 98 at the Ralph, La, the Ralph Lauren store. So next is this. I haven't washed it yet. So I'll just let you look at it from here. Um, but it is Spice of Life from, I believe, the 80s. And Princess Diana wore this. Yes, I'm hiding my bare self behind this. So there's that. Um, Princess Diana wore this um, brand, Spice of Life. So yeah, found it at the thrift store, Goodwill for $6.24. Clearly I'm in a pearl, Upper East Side, old money aesthetic at the moment. But yeah, this, <gasps> ooh, with a white button down underneath. You can't talk to me. You can't talk to me. I'm sorry, I don't make the rules, but I do abide. I'm loving. I'm loving it. This top I got at Goodwill. It's not showing up very well right now. There we go. Okay, 
So I'm not sure of the brand, but when I looked up comps, it was, okay, can you see it? Okay. When I looked up comps, it was like 60 bucks, 80 bucks, something like that. Um, yeah, I think this is so cute. I'm shocked someone gave it away to Goodwill. I'm like really self-conscious about my like large arms. So it like I'm just gonna have to wear this one day when it's just so hot I don't even care anymore. But yeah, okay. Let me know if you like it. I might, you know, I don't know if I like it now looking at it. Not sure, but I do love it. Yeah, $6 at the thrift or $5, I think, in the tank top section. I liked it better in my head. Like, I feel like it would, it's giving me like Real Housewives of Beverly Hills season one and two vibes. Like, this is definitely something Blandy, Brandy Glanville would wear in a drunken rage, and that's my vibe sometimes. I don't know. To be determined, to be determined. Okay, last one. Oh, no, I have one more. Okay. Um, I'm not going to try this on because I would need a strapless bra, which I don't have um, at the moment, so I'm gonna have to get that. But let's think about this. Okay, so I gotta set the tone. So I am wearing white trousers, okay? I am seaside, possibly on a boat. That's the vibe, this handkerchief vents tank, 100% silk is giving me. I think the retail was like 170 or something like that. I paid $17 on Poshmark. So I did have to um, fix like right here. These are not very trusty straps. I did have to fix the straps here and I'm not a very good seamstress. So I did have to fix that um, because they were kind of falling off when I got them. And then when I did actually use it or try it on, it just, it was on its last leg and then I popped it. So I fixed it. It's ready for possibly, I don't know, an ocean, a lakeside, a riverside, no lakeside. Lakeside, Lana Del Rey, Lake George, we're ready for the Hamptons, possibly Miami. Think about this, Miami, right? White trousers, okay? An espadrille, if you will. Oh, with, with my blue blazer. Hello, hello, okay. Yes, with a white trouser. With a white trouser, picture it. And an espadrille on a boat. Yes, and as you know, look at my um, blazer um, collection, thrifted blazer collection. I got this for like $7 at the Goodwill, all wool from like Lord and Taylor or something. So good, so good. I will even put this on, why? I don't know. Blazer, it's giving good, these are quality buttons. If you follow me on Instagram, I just did a whole thing about Zara and their shitty buttons. Okay. A white trouser on a boat. Don't talk to me, I'm done. Next is this top from, believe it or not, originally Walmart. And I got this at Goodwill for like $6. Originally, I think like 17 or I think it was actually originally $24, but I can double check on that. Yeah, cute. Put it up like this, can wear it to work. It's a cute little top. It's giving me girly vibes. I like it with this little watch. The last one I bought to sell, but I might end up keeping. It is this ruched jersey dress from Michael Kors. Has a little Michael Kors thing here. 
Um, I don't know. Do I want to keep it? I don't really know. It's not really my style. It's very, very corporate. It's giving me corporate. It's giving me PTA possibly, but like a high end PTA, you know, like for a private school or like a really good school district, but mostly just corporate. Um, it's not my vibe, but I don't know. Maybe I'll need it. I don't want to get rid of it. Cause what if I need it? I don't know. I'm looking at only selling like higher end stuff now because just selling like sweaters and like, yes, they're like designer, but they're like, I'm selling them for like $30 or $20 and I don't get much from it for the amount of effort it takes. So I'm just selling more designer stuff now, I think. So I don't think that that dress would go for very much. So I don't know if it's worth even trying to sell. I don't know. Okay, so that's it. So I'm bearing my arms. I took off my glasses for you. I am now officially blind. Um, okay, I shouldn't say blind. That's bad. Um, follow me on Instagram, Gossip and Grigio. Podcast, also Gossip and Grigio. On TikTok, same name. And subscribe. Okay, thank you. Bye.